you look at the successful cities across the globe, I doubt if you could find any one of them without a very strong arts and culture environment. Caramel House is the oldest black producing theater in the country. We're the only Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in the entire world. In Ohio, we are the only Latino company who have their own space. Sometimes we feel that everything we do at Piano Cleveland is really internationally known, but is a little bit, we like to call it, the best kept secret in Cleveland. We stand on the shoulders of giants. I would encourage Greater Cleveland never to settle for being second best. Because I do think that this region is one of the great cultural centers in the country. What inspires me about Cleveland is the potential. We have all the assets here. It's about how can we move beyond where we are today. What is the springboard to take us to places that are unknown? but trusting that we need to go there to discover those things and to move forward in it. Because we are a world-class city, a lot of folks know it, we need to believe it. I believe in a culture of constant improvement. You know, whenever you're doing great, you can do even better. The most innovative ideas can come from anybody in your team. So listen, don't judge, and don't put up roadblocks to innovation. Allow people to speak their mind, allow people to fail. We've got to be comfortable with taking a risk that may lead to something that's bigger and better. Just like inspiration, I feel like everything relating to innovation starts with creativity and wonder. Sometimes it's disruptive, and that's a good thing, and, and provocative, and that's a good thing. Collaboration is really important. In fact, Cleveland is a great example of excellent collaboration. There's something about this city where people get it in terms of the importance and benefit of collaborating. Having leaders put their heads together and co-create programming that not only serves the needs of the communities, but also something that people haven't done before. In our every program, in our every activity, we think globally. And I would encourage everyone to engage the world. So making this in Spanish is inviting the Latino community to feel part of Cleveland. It is like giving the Latino area in the community uh, a place to belong. Sometimes when you are so focused, you might not see the opportunities right in front of you. And Cleveland's a place that's changing quickly, and I think that's wonderful. As an organization, we are incredibly forward-focused. We're thinking about what's next, what's coming, where are we going. How can we help merge these visions together for that North Star for the region and use the natural assets of Cleveland to move us forward to the next century for generations to come? And it is about collectively coming together to step into the space and to explore the unknown. We might not know what the end might be, but commit to the journey of better understanding and change. Cleveland has had a great history. We need to rest in confidence with that history, then let's just look to the future and move ahead together.